one chord and the four chord and the five chord. said many, many times to get really comfortable with 1-4-5, be able to play it in both hands. Over the years, I've loved doing this same demo for many, many students, and even in some clinics. Might have a bass player and a drummer. We start really cooking, and I'll play all these things, and then I'll stop and ask them if any one of them could come up and do what I did. And they all say no, of course, but then when they find out that it was just one four five superimposed over a chord progression, they can't believe it. First of all, they can't believe that it's just one four five. And second, they they can can't actually wrap their brain around the fact that they could actually do that with a little bit of development of technique. They could do that too. Now, granted, we want to throw in some chromatic notes. Granted, we want to play by ear out here and from within. So there is a whole other level that we want to get to and hope to get to. But before you ever get anywhere, you need to have those basics down. So I just want to take a second and show you a quick demo, for better or worse, of how this can work for you too. So here we go. Okay, let me set my metronome here. That'll be our bass player, our ride cymbal. Let's just take a look at what happens here.